Good morning, everyone. We are going to get started here in a few minutes. We're just letting everybody trickle in to the session here. Yulia, hello. We did have music, um, but technical difficulties, as always, um, everything likes to go wrong right before you start a conference. So no music, um, unless Matt's going to get on the air and sing or play something for us. Alba. Looking at my other screen over here. Oh, I see the EE. -E. I get it. I see what you guys are doing there. There we go. All right, everybody say hi in the chat. I know we've got more people than what's talking on here. So definitely let us know that you're here. Let us know where you're coming from, where you're, where you're at. Um, anything we should know about yourself. If you're new to the community, make sure to say hi. Um, we love the community. We love what we have here with Expression Engine. And we love each other. So, Jeremy, good morning. Doug, one of our sponsors, Doug's going to be over in his expo booth later. So be sure to stop by the expo during the conference and say hi to him and thank him for all that Triple Nerd Score does to support the community. I think we've got people from Hop here as well. Um, morning, Meredith. All right. Okay, so it's 9.56. So I think everyone that's going to be here for the morning is, is here. So we're going to get started. Um, I record these, so I always got to start fresh every time, but um, we'll try to do this. Um, I'm trying to do this from two different computers, so we're going to see how this works out. So, all right. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the 2023 um, EE Comp Spring Conference. This is our third conference that we've been able to have during the spring virtual conference. Um, COVID obviously was a very horrible thing, uh, continues to... Um, cause problems across the world, but um, it also opened up a lot of different avenues for us to meet as a community. And this was one of those things. This is one of the things that grew out of that era. And um, we're excited to continue this for our third year, excited to bring the Expression Engine community together. Um, we have multiple events throughout the year, if you don't know. Um, EE Conference has events every other month where we just do a, a meetup for a couple hours, have a speaker. And then we have our spring conference, which you obviously know about. And then we have our fall summit, which is in person and is going to be in Orlando this year. So um, be sure to check out early bird tickets for that as well. We'll talk a little bit about that throughout the day. But to get, get things going, um, first of all, I want to talk about our, com our committee. My computer will work here. Um, so EECOMP committee that helps put on the, all these events throughout the year. Um, of course, you guys know all these guys and ladies, and, and be sure to say hi to them if you see them in Slack or in the chat. Um, be sure to tell them how appreciative you are of what we do here. And um, this is all volunteer. If you don't know, EE Conference is completely um, nonprofit. We don't make any money from this. The volunteers don't get paid. Uh, they just work throughout the year to make these events happen for you guys. So be sure to definitely give them a pat on the back and say thank you for all that they do. All right, so of course, code of conduct as a community, our code of conduct is very important to us. Uh, basically, it always comes down to don't be a jerk, right? Uh, we are we're an awesome community. We help inspire each other. We help grow each other, help everybody learn together. And we want to continue that. We want to foster that. So um, if you do feel that anybody is breaking the code of conduct, you can go to eecomp.com slash code of conduct and fill out that form, and that'll notify um, committee members and we'll address it as soon as possible. You can also ping us in Slack or in the chat as well. Um, we've also, like I said, the Slack channel, e conference channel, be sure to get in there and chat and um, talk all about what you're learning today. Um, 
people who are not in the conference can see that channel as well. And, and then people look at that and they realize all that they missed. And next time, hey, maybe they'll join us. So uh, procedures for questions throughout the day. Um, we try to push everybody to do this. It's like full in teeth, but we want to see your smiling faces. We want to hear you guys. We want to hear talk. We want to feel um, a little bit in person here. So during our sessions, if you have a question or during Q&A time, according to how the speaker wants it and the moderator is managing it, um, there's a button in the top of your screen up there that says share audio and video. You can sh press that button and let a moderator know that you have a question and you want to ask it. And then you can ask it in person live to the speaker and have a conversation there. And then when you are done, just press that leave button. Um, it does not exit the session. It just stops your audio and video. So that's just a great way to ask questions. If you're a little too shy for that, that's OK. Um, just make sure that you use the Q&A feature. Ah, and this slide is wrong. It says for the stage. It should say for the session. So on, under session, you'll see a Q&A. Click on that Q&A. Make sure you're in the session. And then a moderator will help moderate those questions during Q&A time for each of our talks today. All right, always wanna um, thank our awesome sponsors. We have Hop Studios again as a gold sponsor. Thank you for all that they do. We have some of the representatives from the team here today with us. Of course, Triple Nerd Score, Doug, he's already said hi. He's gonna be in the expo booth. Um, be sure to talk to him. Um, our bronze sponsors, we have Greenline Creative, Creative Art, Jub Jub, Prime, Complex Group, Buzzing Pixel, Noble Web Development, Bold Minded, names you guys recognize from the community for many years now, um, consistently supporting what we have here. And of course, Friends of E, Mithra, Eric over at Mithra62, thanks for all he does and the contributions he does for the community as well. Um, so how can you support EE Conference? If you love what we do, if you love these conferences, if you love the events throughout the year, um, it's not free to do this. And um, again, we're volunteer ran. Um, if you guys know, we are not connected with the e or e expression engine team. Um, we're independent of that. And we just put these events on because of the community, because we like to grow the community. Um, and so, yes, you know, we need money. It, we always need money. Um, so you can no donate directly. You can also become a sponsor if you're interested in being one of our sponsors that help uh, grow these events throughout the year. All right, so before we get started, I have to shout out to EE Conference Fall Summit on Orlando this year. It's gonna be, um, oh my goodness, I'm blanking on the dates, end of or beginning of October, um, that first week there. So um, there are early bird tickets available. It's all the super early bird tickets sold out, but now we have early bird until we get announced the speakers. We've also opened up the call for speakers. So you can go to cfp.eeconference.com and submit any talks that you wanna present. If you guys were in Philadelphia last year, it was an awesome time. Uh, it was the first time we've done the in-person event as a more summit style. So you can talk to anybody that was there, but you know, all the feedback we got was amazing. Uh, we just sat in rooms and we had somebody kind of present for maybe 15, 20 minutes. And then we just opened up the floor to questions and comments and conversation. And we talked in more of a summit style where we all discussed about what we were experiencing, what we were going through or troubles that we had in our agency or in, in you know, web development or as a freelancer. And it was just a great time of networking and growing and learning together. And we wanna to continue to foster that. We wanna to continue to grow that and, and build upon that this year. So we're gonna be in Orlando at the Rosen Single Creek uh, Resort there. It's an amazing facility. I was down there um, a few months ago and visited and toured it. Um, it's just gonna be a spectacular time. And of course, Orlando, Florida in October is gonna be fantastic weather. So really look forward to seeing everybody there. Make sure you get your early bird tickets before we sell out. Once again, just like last year, we're limiting it to 50 tickets. So because we want the small groups, we want the discussion. So you need to go ahead and grab those before they sell out. All right, so without further ado, Tom, if you will jump on um, to start off the morning. We have um, Tom from the EE team. He's going to give our opening remarks and, um, or I mean, our SATA, <laughs> the slides are, it's going to be the state of Expression Engine and um, what's going on with Expression Engine. I look forward to hearing from him. I kind of miss being on the team and getting all the inside track. Um, I don't have that anymore. But um, Tom, I see you, you there. So I'm going to, let's see if I can stop. Hey, can everybody hear me all right? Manage right now. So I'm going to stop that one and then. I'm also going to leave myself here. 